Okay, so let's talk about seborrheic keratosis, and it's going to be represented by the subway car. A subway car for seborrheic keratosis. Now, if you know, we have an old man here. Help us remember that seborrheic keratosis is, co is a common tumor in the elderly. It's a benign squamous proliferation, and you can see the gross morphology of it right over here. You can see a real picture of it. It's like it this coin-like appearance, and you could sort of look like it's just scratch it off. As they say, a stuck-on appearance. Now this old man over here has this seborrheic keratosis on his face and on his extremity over here by his right foot. To help us remember that seborrheic keratosis appears commonly on the face and on the extremities. He's wearing this carrot suit to help us remember that it's characterized by keratin pseudocysts on histology, as you can see in the picture. Now let's back out for a second. So that was the subway car. Here we have the lesser train. The lesser train is going to help us remember the lesser trailot sign. What's the lesser trailot sign? The lesser trailot sign is when there is a sudden onset of multiple seborrheic keratoses. That's why you see on his face over here, he has multiple of these keratoses over here, and it suggests an underlying carcinoma of the GI tract. And thus we have his GI tract over here with this car coming out of it to help remember the carcinoma of the GI tract. All right, there you have it for seborrheic keratosis and lesser trailout sign. I hope you enjoyed. All right, take care.